Hi, I'm Sarah, part of the sales team at Cranfield Colors, and I'm here to show you just some things to remember when using Caligo Safe Wash. Perhaps you're used to using traditional inks in the studio, and there's really no big difference between traditional and Caligo. Caligo is still oil-based, but you can clean up with soap and water instead of using a white spirit like you would need to use for a traditional ink. When you enter the studio, a good tip to remember is to start off with a bit of barrier cream. It's just going to create a nice coating on your hand to keep them protected from maybe dermatitis or just harsh chemicals that are commonly in the studio. A fun thing that comes along with Caligo Safe Wash is you can reuse things over and over. For example, your tarlatan, if you're an etcher, you can just wash it up in the sink and reuse it a couple more times. Most people use a water trough in the studio, but you can also use a spray bottle. You're just gonna spray your paper and cover it. That way your paper is not overly damp because not with just Caligo, but any ink in general, overly damp paper is going to slow the drying quite a bit. Again, you're gonna be cleaning up with cold soapy water. We've done another video on this if you have any further inquiries about that. And at the end of the day, you probably have some ink left over on your table. You're just gonna scrape it up with your palette knife, put it on some wax paper. Try to fold it up nice and tight so you're keeping it away from oxygen exposure. And you're gonna pop it in a drawer. If you have any further questions, please visit our website at cranfield-colors.co.uk. And that's color with a U, spelled the British way.